final round round of uh, Formula C European Championship, and the final round is at the Mount Bugatti circuit. Let's check this image quickly. Uh, yeah, that was because we I won the last round. And I could skip the round based on the points alone, but let's do it because it's fun. Uh, settings, keeping it around 100. Surprisingly, my I've done some <clears throat> preparation for uh, LMP3 online league, uh, LMP3 endurance championship. Uh, and my wheel is still cooling down after that. It, it's very loud, surprisingly. Let me uncover that. Um, so yes, uh, opponent skill level 100, opponent's aggression at 70. Let's save that. And let's move to practice session. Um, I want to give the wheel a bit of time to cool down just a little bit. Dashboard, tuning setup. That setup is pretty much default. The only difference is, I think, the brake balance. Maybe I don't remember chassis uh, front and rear downforce and some adjustment in tire pressure. Nothing in suspension or dampers, even touch that. Uh, not worth it for 10 laps uh, race. And of course, the fuel load is what I changed. Uh, the rest, I think, is all default. So, that's loaded. So let's just do some... I'll do a few laps first, just to remind myself how to drive that car on the track. And then move to qualifying. I also want to confirm the difficulty at 100. So, do it. Let's do a few laps around the track. Good they don't ask me to drive the whole Le Mans. Now, firstly, I thought that the exit is there on the right hand side, but actually the, the closer one here. It's a good truck temperature, 36 degrees, it shouldn't be hard to warm up those tires, it may still take a few laps. So I'll take it slowly to start with, because they called at the moment at around 40 degrees each. I want them at around 80 obviously, maybe 90 even. car is going to slide around before the tires are uh, in a good working temperature that's expected Hi mate, how are you? Hopefully you're having a good weekend. Yeah, I'm very well, thanks. Trying to finish that Formula C, that's the last race of Formula C ever. Good to hear man, good to hear. trying to warm up those tires in that car. I had 50 degrees at the moment, so it's still really cold. 
but the truck temperature is quite nice, nice, uh, 36 degrees Celsius, so two more laps I guess and those tires should be nice and warm. Yeah, Project Cars 3 is generally very arcadey in comparison to Project Cars 1 or 2. Uh, I don't like that there are no racing weekends, that the races are short, there are no pit stop, tire wear, fuel wear. It's basically not a sim. That's why I don't play it. Oh, I went very wide in that corner. Lost a lot of speed at the exit and the time. Yeah, definitely. If someone enjoys that type of uh, things in the game, like customization and stuff, then yeah, that's definitely a game for, for you. I value more the aspect of simulating the real racing experience, let's call it that way, so you know, car setups rather than car customization, uh, pit stops, long races, like I love to drive two, three hours races, I did I did 24 hour Le Mans actually online, I mean not online but in game. But you know, I like to I like to pop into Gran Turismo and do a few laps there, even though it's kind of simcade, I would say. But it's very enjoyable game. So it's not that I only play Sims. I I like other games too. Uh, Gran Turismo is one of the series which uh, which has been with with me for years now. So I played Gran Turismo one, two, three, four, five, six, and now GTS and. I probably will play Gran Turismo 7, probably not on the day of the release. I don't think it's worth the money they're asking for it. Yeah, Project Curse 2, but also Asta Corsa Competizione, really good game. That would be 1 minute 44, but unfortunately that lap was invalidated. 
I'm not sure what laps I can expect from the AI. Uh, I need to do a last one clean lap just to see how I compare to them. Oh, they invalidated it, invalidated it pretty quickly, didn't expect that. That would be 44 again, very similar lap as the last one, but unfortunately it also was invalidated and the next one will be too. Because I made the mistake in the last sector of that lap. <coughs> yeah, I've seen it, I really like it how it looks like. Generally I really like Lamborghinis and their design. There is a model uh, made from Lego of that Lamborghini. <laughs> it does, it does. I agree. Pretty cool car. Yeah, my favorite Lambo is the Sesto Elemento. The truck only beast, but the way it looks is amazing. Another 44.5, so the last three laps were pretty much identical. This one, hopefully, will be a clean up, clean lap. Yeah, the Veneo, I think they only made like three, right? It's super unique. And they, they, all the three are for United States only, if I'm correct. And it costed like three million dollars or something crazy.
Oh really? I didn't know that. How are they changing them? So that was 1 minute 43, my best lap, and I'm still last. Which is quite interesting, because I think I was gaining to the guy who's in front. One minute forty-two, and that put me puts me at third. So one minute forty-two point six puts me in third, which is where I want to be. Okay, I'll keep the difficulty then. Uh, it's not a big difference. Uh, let me just see that uh, long comment you put in because I wasn't able to read it. Uh, golf colors. Okay, that's cool. I really like the golf colors. Interesting, interesting. I like the green one though, like the, the Huracan GT3, number 63, was running in green. I really like that color. Oh, McLaren. Okay, yeah, McLaren I saw, sorry. I thought we were still talking about the Lambo. Uh, yeah, the McLaren new colors I saw, they're really, really nice. Really nice. Um, I agree. I like the Red Bull car as well. Uh, it's interesting because they put the comparison between the McLaren and the Aston Martin and they showed the differences between those cars and they actually quite significant in how the car looked like from the top. Okay, I'm going to return to pit box, I'm going to skip to end and I will run the qualifying. Whoa. Okay, it's even warmer now than it was during the practice. It's 39 degrees, which is good. Should be easier to warm up the tires. Surprisingly, actually, it wasn't that easy to warm them up during the practice, even though it was like 36 degrees. Yeah, exactly, that's what it looks like. Also, the midsection of the car looks wider at um, in Aston Martin when comparison to McLaren. Sure, sure. Get a good position here. Just remember, we only need one top lap.
too big of a slide unfortunately but the tires are still a bit coldish so I don't have the full grip I would like to have for that qualification. That's too slow, 1 minute 44.5 That's too wide. It looks like they're significantly slower in the last two corners. Okay, I have enough heat now in the tires. They're still not perfect. Uh, the rear right is still cold. But the rest show green. fifth with 1 minute 42.374 maybe I'll be able to improve that time a little bit Welcome back. I'm trying to improve my time, maybe maybe get a full position, though I doubt I'll be able to do that. I'm fifth at the moment. It's not bad. 
I'm running the AI at 100%, so they're pushing hard. With water? How that how is that possible? <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah, how is that even possible? <laughs> I would understand to float float the house with water, but burn it down? <laughs> That's quite hard to do, right? <laughs> I messed up the last sector. I was quicker in the first two. One more try. Looks like I can be quicker. Slower in the first sector, unfortunately. So it's not a good start. Improve just a little bit, 15,000 of a second, not much. I know I can do better. Almost too wide, luckily still within the truck limit, but still slower that first sector. Okay, better in sector 2, just a few more corners. And too wide at the exit of the last corner, but that would be 1 minute 41.9. Okay, I'm going to keep the fifth fifth time. I think it's going to make for an interesting race. That was just 0 0.4 slower than the first one. Um, yeah, okay, let's skip to the end and let's move to the race. 10 laps, average fuel consumption 1.35. Check if I have enough fuel. Yeah, definitely. Uh, what are the temps? 32, it's even warmer. Good. Two wide, left side. 
On your rear right corner. Clear. Watch your right. He's still there. Clear. Interesting start, a good one actually. All clear. Oh, they're really fast in that corner. Two legs behind. Oh my... I locked the wheels, I had to brake really hard because I was braking too late. Significantly slower than I than I expected at the exit of the turn. That's your best first sector so far. Keep it going. He's two lengths back. Right 
side. On your right side. Better exit from the last Left corner. Side. Still there. Too wide at the moment. Still left. Still there. You got one on your left. Oh come okay, on, you're really. Clear. On your left. He's cleared you. One length behind. He's two lengths behind you. One length behind. I cannot keep their pace in that corner, that right-hander. Fastest first section you've done so far. Great stuff. One minute 42.7, that's around my qualifying time. But I was running the same setup and the same fuel for qual even, so that all adds up. Had to slow down or I would crash into him. Halfway through the race, starting from P5 at P3 at the moment. All tires are nice and warm, brakes are cold though. I could brake later here, but I don't want to take a risk. I cannot see that braking point well enough driving behind them. 
and I don't want to crash into one of them. Four laps to go. Okay, that was a good attack on P2, and P2 is mine at the moment. I have a bit more than 3 laps to try to attack P1. Huge slide. Watch right, got a car right. Clear now. Three laps to go. Two legs behind. That exit might have been Still good left. enough, we'll see. Still left. Still left. One on the left. Nice one, you're clear. You've got one, two legs back. Two laps to go, and I am at P1 on P1 at the moment. So let's see if I can keep that. One leg behind. Oh, I had a really slow exit from that corner. On your left rear. But I have the inside to the next corner. One left. Nowhere. Oh, he went really close to me. All clear. Half length back. 
he will attack here. They, they are fast in this corner, so I was expecting an attack here. And that's what happened. Back to P2. Exit again from the last corner. Still there. All good, you're clear now. Okay, he really slowed down there, not sure why. They're usually much more aggressive. He's two legs back. Length back. Hey, they're racing behind my back. Two lengths behind you. Half length back, watch your line. Car right. Clear. Two lengths back. Okay, best on the distance. I don't think I have to defend the inside. If he was closer, I would have to. Now or never, mate. Push as hard as you can. One leg behind. I like the last four corners, so I should be good. That was enough to win. Well, that was a cool race actually. Starting from uh, fifth, I was expecting some fight. I didn't expect to win. A final cooldown lap in my Formula C car in this career. That was the last race of Formula C of European Championship and I'll be moving to Tier 4 Formula Renault. I'm really curious how those Formula Renault cars are to drive. I didn't enjoy those Formula C cars much really hard to warm up tires in them uh, a few races were in a very cold conditions in February in March so it was cold tires racing for me which was very unpleasant the car was skidding a lot But I can forget about Formula C now and can focus on something new. That was a masterful piece of driving. Great job, bud. See you in the pit. Perfect. Uh, one second at the end. How was my teammate? I cannot see him here, so he was out of the first 10. Well, I, let's see if... We have enough points to win the championship as a team. Uh, extra point for our fastest lap. Same amount of points as the second team in that race. A win in the driver classification and a win as a team. Good, perfect. Couldn't have been any better. 
unfortunately, the game doesn't allow me to skip. Yeah, that's the accolade I wanted. And the game asks me now to do the World Championship. I, if I, I don't want to do because I already, I already have done World Championship while I was doing US Championship. So I have to go through every single race and skip it, which is time consuming, which I won't be doing online. I'll do it offline and I will come back online uh, probably somewhere midweek to, to, to start a Formula, Formula Renault. So I want to all thank you for watching, for chatting. It was really nice to be here today. And I will see you next time. Enjoy your Sunday.